What's up, guys? I am a concerned incel. Um, so, one of my favorite YouTube channels I can't find right now. It could be that I'm just incompetent and that it's I'm just not able to find it. I haven't been able to find their cover of uh, Beamer Boy, like the song Beamer Boy, the Voltage video. And it, so I think what this ushers into me, a concept that I've only just coined, I'm going to call it Shadow Torture. We've all um, familiar with the term Shadow Band, which is a frightening enough concept in itself, which is that they, whoever they are, Whoever is curating what you are given and shown on your computer screen on YouTube, when you're just browsing, you just want to open up YouTube and relax, um, can curate what you see, boost signals they like, diminish signals they don't like. So if they've nuked, if, if Up to the Wolves has been Epstein, if intelligence agencies, perhaps this could be who they are, have deemed that the sort of radicalization, the sort of radical cultural movement that Up to the Wolves is facilitating and, and hosting is not conducive to their ends, then it's better to get rid of it. If that's what happened, I think they were very heavy handed. They could have probably shadow banned Up to the Wolves up to the point where he was getting no traffic. <sighs> But the concept that comes to mind is shadow torture, the gaslight that is possible with the internet. So let's say, for example, that I've, I'm a competent, high IQ individual who's, who's kept a cool head and been looking for the Up to the Wolves YouTube channel and not been able to find it because they're hiding it from me. And then if I make a video like this, trying to talk about it, um, it's very possible that they could unshadow ban it. Look, up to the wolves is right here, dude. You must have just been. You just you're you're not a very competent person. You got you're kind of hysterical. Both things are true, but you just couldn't find it, man. Relax. Every we're not shadow torturing anybody. That would be an example of of gaslight that I've come to just now think of as shadow torturing. And I think the more immersed and the more of our social and parasocial and political needs we get from the internet, the more possible it is to torment people for the sake of controlling them. So I'm making this video in a hurry. I'm going to go play soccer and kick footballs and cultivate real skills that make me give me endorphins and the health benefits of exercise in the daylight in a real field. And hopefully I will be brave enough to not try and be a internet music superstar, but instead organize and play real shows with the, of the music I'm making in real life, maybe do real stand up, even though they're, they're Marxist open mics, you know, build the bridge, go out into real society and cultivate those because that would take a lot more for anyone to manipulate and subvert and fuck with and grassroots justice movements can happen at things like real gigs. And it's much harder to disrupt than internet communities where people say what they really believe. So that's all. I just wanted to spread awareness of the potential, you know, from a feverish, insane, unempowered, neurotic mind, the healthy people listening with much more to lose and much less incentive. I, I would like them to see some of the possibilities for propaganda and control that the internet is facilitating and that people are slipping into and i hope up to the wolves comes back and i hope we do not allow ourselves to become so live in such a virtual reality that we can be shadow tortured and gaslit because there was an event a couple years ago with some kind of virus that happened that kind of just reminds me that people can be shaped and sh shadow tortured into compliance. So thanks for watching. Let's all go outside and do some push-ups. It could, maybe it's as simple as that.
if we all went outside more and did some push-ups and spoke our mind in real life a little bit more instead of huddling on these internet communities that are almost infinitely manipulatable and, and fuckable. So, here we go. Uh, thanks for listening. Shout out to Up to the Wolves. Shout out to my incels.